with their second album, Modern Love, the Kids of 88 are a non-stop powerhouse band. Today we get to catch up with the lads themselves. The Kids of 88 are one of New Zealand's most popular bands, with smash hits like My House in just a little bit, helping them rise to Kiwi superstardom. They've just released their second album and have been touring New Zealand all summer long. I'm here with the talented lads from Kids of 88. Now guys, how's your day been going? It's been fantastic, thank you. We've only been in Wellington for homegrown for the last about 45 minutes or so, but in that brief period of time, it's been fantastic. We've got this icebox here with a couple of crazy questions in it. Icebox. Icebox, would you, would you mind picking out some questions and answering them? How deep do I need to dig in this icebox of yours? Uh, go just go oh, crazy. Opening there? Stick it in there. Go, 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 go. I'm opening up for you. That's it, all right. Yeah. First paying job you had. Oh, I don't think I've ever had one of those. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, still not, no. Yeah, um, I was a uh, runner at a restaurant and ended up being a waiter and then a barman, so I did the, the whole swag. I worked place. at a BP station for a day and a half, believe it or not. Turns out that I wasn't cut out to fill up cars with petroleum, as it turns out. You need to be quite gruff to, hit, to handle that task properly, so it's a good thing that music came along and swept me off my feet, otherwise I'd still be pumping gazettes. There we go. Who is one of your heroes and why? Hmm. I've got too many of them, I think. I think, pro I don't know why this brings it to mind first, but probably Jimi Hendrix, only in that it kind of exposed me to the realm that is music and sort of showed me the ropes. So, yeah. Have you got any big heroes? I'm looking at them right now. Oh. Masad is, is, is a fantastic entertainer. You guys, you guys are too kind. What do your family and friends always to tease you for? Probably my, my accent. <laughs> um, I don't know. I'm usually, actually, I'm more the one in the family that teases everyone else. I know this is hard to say for a 25-year-old male, but cleaning up after myself. So if I'm making something in the kitchen, I usually kind of leave it there for the odd 20 minutes and then kind of forget about it with the best intentions. A gadget you can't do without. My iPhone is... I couldn't go a day without it. No, I don't know. I get, I'd probably say phone. Yeah. Computer went down the other day and I, I lost my mind. I went, how am I going to survive? Alternate job options you always dreamt about. I think I would probably dream of being an architect if I wasn't doing music. What's, what have you guys got coming up next? Because you just released a new album, which is amazing. Thank you. I'm a big fan. I Thank love you. it. Um, what, what else have you guys got coming up? Uh, we've got a slew of shows throughout the rest of March and April, and then I think we're heading off overseas, so it should be a pretty exciting 2013. And whereabouts are you going? Uh, hopefully the US. And whereabouts can we go to find out more info about you guys? Uh, Facebook is a good one. It is such a uh, 2013 thing, and you will find a lot of information on there. And we also we do a little bit of tweeting just to update a few things, so yeah, get in touch. Awesome. You heard it here, guys. Make sure you get in touch on Facebook and Twitter. And if you want to grab a copy of their latest album, head along to iTunes now. Woo! Nice to meet you. I'll see you later.